Chapter 2 Already, my arm is getting tired, and virals never do. There's just too damn many of them! Never tried this before. Berg will be pissed if I lost an entire shipment of bullets. But since I'm pretty sure he set me up to get me killed, I can't really give a shit about what he thinks about anything. Not just the rounds, the sound will draw them away from me, but not for long. The source of the burning, the jet fuel, hopefully there's just enough oxygen to get me to the terminal, well, name these days. Aisha's intel says there's gold in there, through Biter Central. Fortunately, she set me up with one of her more ingeniously simple craft jobs, with a smartphone and roller skate. Hopefully, that'll keep them busy long enough for me to... Got it! There's a golden mana pack in here. The last edition came out the day of the collapse. Surprised somebody like Eagle would care so much about stupid game cards. But I long ago stopped trying to figure out how people were born back when there was still a human world to think about anything. If we give him enough of these stupid cards, he's going to get me and Aisha off this island and away from Berg. So that's reason enough for me. Berg is right about one thing, though. Nostalgia is the worst kind of drug. You can stop checking your watch, Aisha. He's not coming back. What do you want about, Harry? If you're not going to help me make these spare casings into gunpowder and firecrackers, just leave me be. Died, I mean, I know you've known each other since you were kids, since you were airlifted out of Haran together, but you you shouldn't just be with someone just because you're from the same country or whatever. What's that supposed to mean? I mean, neither of us are from this country originally. We have more in common than you think, yeah. We're both thinking about Died. I am because you made me. Why are you so sure Dade isn't coming back? Just, just, uh, just a feeling. Hey, you little snot! Get back here! Harry, what did you do? Harry, I control all the light traps. I rigged them myself. There, you can't hide in the shadows from me. Don't you dare! Harry? <gasps> gotcha! Harry, what did you do? Let me up! Let me up out of here! It's too dark, it's too dark! Let me into the light, Aisha! Sure, I'll let you into the light, Harry. I'll let you into the light! But first, tell me why you were talking about Daid. I love you, Aisha. I've loved you for a long time. Daid now! Daid's planning on leaving here, taking you with him. I know. That was my idea. I really want to leave you here, Harry. I want to leave you in the darkness forever. Only thing that's stopping me is that you tell me where Daid is. You know where he is, the burning. But I slipped the smoke alarm into his bullet pack. He's not coming back. Now you see, <laughs> you and I can be. Aisha, what are you doing? Don't go after Daid! He's a goner! We're- we're meant to be together! That's the only reason any of this makes any sense! Not sure what the best play is here. Play dumb and pretend like nothing happened and the smoke alarm never went off? Or confront Berg over him trying to kill me? I would so like to have it out with him once and for all. But smarter, maybe not to let him know I know he's onto us planning to escape the city. At least not until Aisha and are ready to leave. Then, then we'll have words. Berg, man, I got some bad news. Died. The shipment to the Berserkers, I- You didn't make it. Yeah, I know. And you're gonna tell me who you sold our ammo to. Or all of you little playmates here are going bye-bye. Aisha. Aisha, I don't see her. Am I too late? Did Berg already get rid of her? What do you do with our re-up, little man? We heard a ton of shooting out of the airport. Who was doing target practice? Nobody. Well, me, I mean. I got cornered by a bunch of virals. Had to toss the bullet shipment into a fire to set them off, which let me escape. Ugh, wow. So you totally act in self-defense, that's totally reasonable <laughs> for you! Me, though. I don't give a rat fart about whether you live or die. So, you still owe me, Berg? You give us a little ammo in exchange for protection from us. Berserkers, whatever you can find. In return, we won't give any of the wee wounds any boo-boos. This time. Yo, bear shirt, check it out. Mana cards, gold series. You know how much this shit would still be worth if there were still a world? Our stash. What are you, their age? Grow a pair, Hoder. Can I keep him bare shirt, can I? I don't care to answer that question. Sweet, sounds like a yes to me. Better not happen again, Berg. Tell your Rugrats that their number one rule when it comes to self-preservation shouldn't be to piss me off. Later, losers. Died, man, I'm glad you're okay. And I know you never failed us before, but I, I gotta say, you picked the wrong day to start, man. Berg, I swear to God, you better tell me what you did to Aisha now or I'm going to- Aisha, what are you talking about? I was hoping you knew where she was. What? Are, are you- 
Torvert overheard Harry yelling she was going after you, and now Harry's gone too. I wouldn't do anything to Aisha, what are you trying to say? Shut up! This is bad. If Aisha's headed to the airport, she could run smack into that mob of virals. But the Berserkers have our gold. That's how we were going to get out of here. Should I go after her or them? What would she say? Go get that stash, idiot. You're turning 18 in just a few months. And then Berg will disappear you too. Okay, girl. Okay. If you say so. Chapter 3 Yeah, suck on that, Moody, yeah? Berserkers on the rage! The Berserkers' vehicles were built for off-roading, so they do pretty well in ruined city streets. But a lot of zigging and zagging is still required. On the rooftops, though, I could go as the crow flies, so I can keep up with them. Hold up. Let's go, Meat. Clear the way. Rest of you, maintain a perimeter. That one. I heard him called Hoder. He's got me and Aisha's stash. Can't take on all these psychos single-handed. Need an equalizer. Really could use some survivor's luck right now. Which is just a superstition way of saying, use what you've got, to make your own luck. Bunch of bombers over there. It's not perfect, but I'll take it. Hey! Handsome! Over here! <laughs> Heads up, bombers! Let them have it! Use exploding arrows! Don't let them get close! Now, while they're distracted, the hell? Oh, hold her! You missed her self-preservation! Damn it! Now I owe you twice, but I only need to collect once. Bear shirt, look out! Guys, watch out! There! Oh no! Oh no! The stash up in smoke! I'm sorry, Aisha. I failed you. What? What does it matter anymore? Oh. Tide, come on! Follow me! Harry? Where where do you little shits think you're going? You won't get far. Harry, what are you doing here? I need your help to save Aisha. What do you mean? What happened to her? Did she go back to the burn? Th that was her plan, but listen! I was hiding when the Berserkers came to Berg's. And then I overheard Berg taking on a walkie to the Duke after you left. What of mine, Tide? The boyfriend's of the new one, Aisha. I think he knows about our arrangement, and I think he's pissed. I don't know what you were expecting, Doctor. It's not like this setup was going to last forever. Over. I know, just... I was I was hoping it'd be a little longer. Are you going to kill me? Over. Haven't made my mind up yet. All I know is that you need to tell me where your girl Aisha is. She belongs to me, just like the others. Her true home, the voice said, is the palace. That means Berg's been selling us to the Rooks when we turn 18. Yeah, he's been selling us to the Duke. Hell is wrong with you people? You come out of nowhere, sweep me off the street. Where's my scooter? Where's a- Oh, Karina, Mia, it's been years. I haven't seen you since you turned 18 and left Berg's place. How have you- Ugh. Don't you remember me? Aisha, before you came here, we have no memories before. We have always lived in this palace. Right, except when you didn't, when you were kids. When I was a child, I spoke as a child. I understood as a child, I thought as a child. But when I became an adult, I put away childish things. Your childhood is over, Aisha. Let's see if you survive second birth. Second? Ugh, I see. You've joined a cult. No, a cult implies a belief in the supernatural. We are all about reality here, Mia. Uh-huh. Can I at least get some color in my wardrobe? Keep spouting jokes if it makes you more comfortable. In the end, all empty words will be burned away by the fire. And we'll see if there's anything left. Aisha, do you know who I am? Let me take a guess, you're the Duke. Berg tells me you're from Haran, is that right? I visited there once, back when there was a world. They had the most amazing meat pies there. Mutin, right, with tomatoes and cilantro? And crushed cordamom. Yeah, my mother used to sell them on the street in Old Town. I can still taste them. That's right. You ready for your second birth, Aisha? You succeed, you become one of our subjects. You get a partner assigned to you, you get a real life family, you get a life. I've got to warn you though, girl, just like in olden times, lots of babies die in childbirth. I pass by the palace almost every day, but I've never seen it up close before. Duke's guys knocked down all the surrounding buildings so we can't parkour our way over there. Hey, Dide, take a look, power line. 
brackets are new. Maybe they can actually draw power from the plants. Looks pretty sturdy, but will it support our weight? I'll go first. Test it. I'm several stone lighter than you. If I can make it, there's a chance you can. You know, Harry. What? You're alright. The other kids thought you were stuck up. Not used to English manners, maybe. Y yeah, that's that's gotta be it. But you're alright, kid. You're alright. You know Berg tried to kill me, right? By slipping a noisemaker into my packet? If I ever get the chance, I'm gonna make him pay. But, but, but saving Aisha should be uh, more important, right? Yeah, you go for it. I'll be right behind. Okay, Aisha. Here goes everything. Harry! 